Yes. Today we are going to see how to install Visual Studio, right? If you want to install Visual Studio, first we have to open a Visual Studio website. Let's search it. Uh, let me open Visual Studio website. Go to your browser. Just go to your browser. Type what? Code dot Visual Studio dot. Then in this one, go for with downloads, or you can directly choose what. So download for Windows. We have an option here at the. So my system is Windows option. That's why I'm choosing what download for Windows. In case your system is Mac OS, then choose Mac OS. In case your system is Linux, then choose Linux. So depends on your operating system, you can choose what your download version. So I need this one download for Windows. Okay, yeah, stable build. Okay, just go for this option. Download for what? Windows. Yeah, it takes some time. Uh, let me give the time. Just download. Now, once it is downloaded, just observe here. Here, yeah, it's in downloaded. The setup is ready. So, select here, then go for what? Show in folder. Go to where your downloads. VS Code, user setup, something 64 bits, some version, whatever the version 20. Just what you will do, double click on this icon. Yes. Now it is asking, I accept the agreement. Yes, I accept the agreement. After that, what you will do? Select the next option. Choose the path where you want to install, right? So it needs just 303 MD space, not more. Then go for what? Next option. And Visual Studio Code, click on what? Next. Yes, then click on what? And next option. And finally, you have to select what? Install option. Of course, it has to finish. Let me finish. Yeah, good. Then select an option called what? Finish option. Yes. Once you install Visual Studio, now we are going to get a window like this, right? Uh, by default, what you have? Ba dark color you will get. The background is dark. No, no, I don't want dark background. I want light background. Then here you can choose the light background. So light color. So it's your choice. Uh, I would. Uh, I personally like what this background is light color. So I choose what light color, right? And then if you want to do your program. What we have to do? go to file, choose new file. So here you can do HTML code, JavaScript code, or else what Python, whatever the thing you want, you can do that one. Just here we have an option called select a language, choose the language. Here, what type of code you want to do? Sir, you, I want to develop C language, sir. choose the C language. So I want to develop C, choose C. I want to do C sharp, then choose C sharp. So what is the requirement you can choose? So I want to develop what uh, Docker code, then you can choose Docker. Here we have different options that are available. Whatever the thing you need, just choose that one. My requirement is HTML code. I want to use HTML, right? Yes. So if your requirement is Python, then write Python. What is your requirement? Write that one. Fine. Java, then Java. C sharp dot net, C sharp dot net. So I will do one small HTML program, choose HTML, select what? HTML file. Right? My requirement is I want to do some small HTML file. Uh, here, in HTML, right? Edit that. First, HTML starts with HTML. 
So I want to increase font size. Control plus. Then it will increase. Let's zoom it. Now inside head tag. Head open. Head close. I open HTML, right? So close HTML also. Here I want to write body tag. Then write your body tag. What do you do? Close body tag. Inside of the body tag, I just want to display a very simple one. So it's my first application. It's my first application. Close paragraph tag. I'm not doing uh, big things. I just write one small uh, paragraph tag. If you need uh, in, uh, heading one. So this one, you can mention with what? Heading one. Close your head. That's it. Once you've done your program, what do you do? I, I, I just want to do HTML code. That's why I did HTML code. If your requirement is Java, do the Java program. Or she, C language, do C language. C sharp, do C language. C sharp, do. C sharp program. Whatever the program you want, write that program. Go to file menu, save option. Now you can save in any folder. I'm going to save, I'm going to save where in D drive. Uh, Yes, I created a folder. My folder is HTML. VS HTML is my folder. In VS HTML, this is my first example. So, example one. Dot HTML. Whether you mention or you won't mention, no problem. By default, it will save it. What dot HTML observe here? Example one dot HTML. Because starting itself, you choose the option called what? HTML option, right? That's why by default it comes as HTML. So program done. Once your program done, next step, what we have to do? Go to that location. Yes, go to the location where you saved your file, right? In D drive, VS HTML is my file. Object example one. Now, if you want to execute this, what you will do? Either double click or right click and open with your choice. The browser is your choice. Internet Explorer, Microsoft Edge, Google Chrome, or Firefox. Any browser, you choose any browser. I, I just want to choose Google Chrome, select it, Google Chrome. That's it. It's what? My first application. This is a way we have to install Visual Studio and we can work with Visual Studio. Right? Thank you guys.